So at the line, Pro Stock Motorcycle, it's the final pair, and it's the number one qualifier, Hector Arana and David Hope. Arana and Hope both on a Buell, and Hope, he's had some very strong moments. Let's see what he can do against Hector. David Hope's been running really well this week, and I mean, he, even though he qualified number nine, he was making some consistent runs in all kinds of conditions. He took out Hector Arana's son, Hector uh, Jr., in the first round. Now he wants to try and take out the old man. Hector got the advantage off the starting line. That should be plenty. Oh, wow. Hector evens that one out. 726, 183 miles an hour for Hector Arana. I'll teach him for taking out my boy. Yeah. Don't you mess with my kid. <laughs> oh. So the number one qualifier continues to move ahead. One more look at it. Hector had the advantage by uh, almost 200 in the second, and then he never looked back. That that bike was on a, on a string. Wow. With Hector Arana, who advances now to the semifinals, they're kind of playing peekaboo with cloud cover on this racetrack. But with that cooling system up there, Hector, does that make your tuning job easier? Oh, no, definitely. No doubt. I mean, we've been consistent. This being the most consistent uh, that we've seen at the, at the uh, starting line. So, you know, my, my guy's doing a great job on this Lucas Oil bike. And I want to thank them. And I want to thank the Safety Safari because they're doing a hell of a job. Thanks. Hector Arana was just hauling when he took that win against David Hope. Good man, Hagen. What's going on there? It looks like black eyes. Whit Baysmore, can you update us? I sure can, Paul. Those are not black eyes. Well, they are kind of black eyes. That is clutch dust. Driving a funny car is a very, very dirty job, especially up here on the mountain where traction is at a premium and you're slipping the clutch a lot. That means more clutch dust in the car and more on your face. Yeah, but when I don't ever remember you getting your face dirty. 